Is it real? Is it real? Are they gonna do it? Have they done it? They- come on, they've done it, haven't they? They've done it, they've done it. I'm sure. I'm sure they've done it. YES! Oh, yes! Hello and welcome to an amazing episode of the Glacier Tournament! And today, we're gonna be reviewing and buying the all new creatures! So because we have saved a lot, a lot of bucks, Oh god, I don't even have space for these creatures. I, I've been redoing my park and this guy's humongous! So we'll get him. We shall also... G oh my god, look at this guy! Motherium! Wow! He's a big fatty, isn't he? Who's a big fatty? So we'll get him. We will also get... Uh, Melonia! Oh my god, you are massive too! Oh jeez! And we shall also get... You, the Ap Apolicumus, Apolicumus, oh, what, whatever that means. <laughs> so uh, we'll just quickly get them. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, that's a huge one, humongous. Okay, now these, some of these will take a lot of bucks, and some of them won't. So forty-five bucks ain't too much. Uh, one hundred twenty-five bucks is a lot. Uh, one hundred sixty-nine bucks is a lot, and seventy-seven bucks isn't much. So. We're gonna start with a uh, herbivore because it doesn't have fences, and that's how you can tell that it uh, that it's a herbivore. So its name for sorry, its name from Greek is high camel because of its long neck and tall stature, standing almost ten feet tall. That's four foot taller than me. Sorry, ten ten feet. Is ten feet tall? That's six feet. No. Ten foot. It's not, it's feet the same as foot, because if it is, that's not too much taller than, uh, than me, but if it's 10 foot, if I'm thinking, that's low. So we're gonna quickly level up to level 10, and I'm noticing that all of these creatures are in fact gold, so honestly, I cannot wait to use this. Oh my god, look at them! Gangly! Again, these creatures do not have nicknames, so feel free to leave nicknames. Oh god, they look beautiful! I'm gonna call these Goombas, or, um... Oh, what's what's the Mario's? Koopas! They're gonna be the Koopa Troopers! I'm sorry, they are Koopa Troopers! The spikes and armored tail make some scientists think that Melonia shares ancestry and ancestry with the Ankylosaurs. Really? Wow, that would be an amazing feat for these things to be related to dinosaurs, especially after dinosaurs like were extinct. Wow. I mean it does look very similar. And look at that! Oh, we are living in the golden age! Oh my giddy and Okay, so the the boar crocodile stalked prehistoric Africa during the Cretaceous, so we are seeing something that isn't Glacier. Oh, look at it! It's so cute! He's got little eyes. So again, we're gonna feed this bad boy! Yum, yum, yum! Oh, absolutely wonderful. He looks amazing. I'm, I think we're seeing some unique animations for these creatures. Uh, and this one, I think this is the final one. Uh, yes, the beast from Lake Morris lived in the swamps and rivers of the Eocene Epoch. Ah, oh, there it is, little dumpling. Who's a little dumpling? I'm a little dumpling. I think that's what I'm gonna call him. I'm gonna call him Little Dumpling. Oh, God, again. A big one. Oh, cha -cha. And I think, I think that is it. Um, I might have to do something that I would not suggest to you guys. And that is, in fact, to uh, buy... I think I'm going to buy bugs just to max these guys out and use them all in the tournament. Um, how much do... Like, never do this. Never do this. Um, but since this is my livelihood... Um, there isn't any real problem. I mean, I got 5,000 bucks from just playing the game already. So these, these are creatures that you just wouldn't normally see uh, unless you play the game completely. But my god, this is the biggest money spinner I've ever seen uh, in this completely. So, uh, oh god, $99. It's $100, Jesus. Wow, that is a lot of money when you think about $99. Uh, okay, so you can't, you can't get bucks from doing free things, so, uh, what I am gonna do is level these guys up first, 
So see you in a minute. Right, hello. Jesus, these things are butt guzzlers, gold guzzlers. But my God, we're back finally. So let's start with this little guy. Number 19. If I, if I can click it, oh, it hasn't loaded yet. So we're gonna start with this one then. Melonia. Uh, 76 bucks it isn't too much. Boom, there it is. Oh, I love these guys. The Koopa Troopers. Level them up. Because I have enough resources, enough bucks to level them up and max them up and take them on the tournament. And God, I'm excited. I feel like a child on Christmas. Oh, okay, your turn. They were pretty. But uh, can you outdo them, Lanky, ha lanky Camel? <gasps> oh, she's got spotties. So let's click and level them up. And then what we'll do is we'll go over and see what they will be like. And Max, oh, I'm going to save that lizard for last because he's the best one. Let's see the hippo elephant um, horse thing. 125 bucks. Oh, not as pink anymore. Oh, I like the really paley pink. Oh, he's like a piggy. Little dumpling. Little dumpling. Uh, and there it is. Woo! You are making a dent into my resources, my young friend. My tubby friend. And you, lizard, 168 bucks. Oh, it hurts. It hurts a lot. <laughs> so far, I haven't bought any books yet, so I could at least get them all to the second level. Oh, he looks so cool. I'm going to call you Gatorade. Do you like that name that I just came up on the spot? I do. It sounds really good. So, level. There we go. Woo. So. This thing maxed up. Yes, it's gonna look incredibly badass, but not only that, he's gonna have 7,000 health. For a carnivore, that is insane. 7,000 health with an attack of 3,240. We're talking almost on par. We're talking T Rex standards here. We're talking about maybe even 5 thousand damage for a special attack we're probably going to get four thousand and with those teeth i'm not going to argue so how's little pudding do no don't talk to the anvacoons they're sleeping they're sleeping leave them sleep so you tubby uh eight thousand you're gonna have eight thousand five hundred health with one two thousand six seven hundred two thousand seven hundred and sixty four damage wow okay you're good too uh, this one's gonna be the second best. Uh, you've got six, seven... Wait! Second... Seven thousand six hundred health? With one... Two thousand four hundred and forty-eight attack. Oh my god. And poor, poor little scrawny scrawn. Ah, at least we've got Indocatherium uh, animation here. Another one. Uh, six thousand six hundred and fifty health with... 2,144 attack. Not bad. Not amazing, but what am I talking about? It is absolutely amazing. All of these creatures are going to be the best. They're going to be so good. I cannot wait to see them in the listings. And I cannot wait to level them even more. I am probably going to have to buy some books uh, just to fi finally max them out. I won't need to spend it on resources, which is great. But Lydia, I just want to say... You have done amazing. Like, oh, these creatures look unique. You spent a lot of time in the models. And you've done your research. I thought you were running out of ideas when you ideas when you recycled Giganotosaurus. Uh, Gigantosaurus, sorry. And now you come out with these? This is, I mean, yes, it's a big book swindler. But the thing is, for people that keep playing this game and have like 9,000 bucks, this is going to take them down to 1,000 bucks if, that, if they want to max them all up like I'm doing. And... I am so happy that I get to show you guys these because I know a lot of you have messaged me like instantly as soon as he's out. Comments on videos, every single video. And it doesn't even matter if it's related to Jurassic Park Builder. You're just like, you creatures! <laughs> so, oh, I'll be right back. Let me level them up. We get colors. Beautiful, beautiful colors. So, welcome back. And we're gonna hatch them now. I did just go and buy some books on the sly because it's quite expensive. I mean, think about 5,000 books. If 1,500 books costs about $100, then 3,000 books costs $200, and 6,000 books costs $400. I had 5,400 or something, so that's like... 
$600. That's mental. That's crazy. Okay. Let's start the crazy train by hatching this little beast. Oh god, the lag. The lag is real. I've got too many creatures on the map, so let's hatch for 76 bucks. Oh, I forgot to guess what color it was going to be. <laughs> I got too excited. Oh, it looks beautiful. Oh, that is a nice color. Nice color you got going there, Koopa Troopers. I cannot wait to see what you do. Are you going to be more death balls? I bloomin' well hope so. You're probably usable about now, actually. 5,700 health. That's pretty awesome. What could the little endocatherium be? What color? Okay, um... Let me guess. Let me guess. Endocatherium is blue. What's the opposite of blue? Red. Red seems too weird. We're gonna go with orange. I'm gonna go with orange or oh, brown. Orange brown. What we're gonna be? Brown! There we go! You see, we've got the color instantly! So let's level up little lanky legs. I think that's what I might call it, lanky legs. Or lanky Larry. What do you think? Lanky legs or lanky Larry? Leave in a comment below which one you prefer. Uh, this sort of video I'm, I'm doing right on the spot, so I don't have any characters, I don't have any... Like, they will probably get their own unique thing. I've had something, uh, like, in mind for Baculitis or Baculits for ages, so, uh, definitely when they come soon, even, uh, he's definitely- I'm gonna save the- I'm gonna save Gatorade for a little bit, we're gonna hatch a little dumpling! Okay, I'm gonna say pink. I want it to be pink. I want it baby pink. What do you think, guys? Uh, blue! Ooh! Pinky purple! Not bad, he's got a pink head with a purple body. Although it looks like he's rolled in mud. Some sort of mud, but I gotta say, beautiful! Little fatty. Oh god, look at it, it's like, I cannot cope with these amount of creatures. So, Gatorade, what color could Gatorade be to join the sort of reptile crew? Um, let me think, let me think, let me think, what color? I want a red, Megalania color, what we're gonna get? Ooh, purpley blue, nice! Oh, that is cool, that's a cool color, I like it. <laughs> we will click, but it's like because there's so many things, but it looks awesome. Looks really, really good. Oh, man. I love it. Yes! Wow. We have uh, we've got so much. We've got one more evolution, and then we'll go in the tournament. I don't know how many creatures I've got left, but I know I've got at least two or three maxed. Like, uh, Indrakathum I didn't use, Karif, Little Brute I didn't use. And accompanied with these four creatures... Like, that's basically a tournament one, so it's gonna be like 20 bucks, but we're gonna do it anyway, so, uh, join me in the second round, max them out again! Welcome back! And this is the final, the final evolutions for them. So, wow, then we'll take them for a spin in the tournament. Uh, final colorings, it was purple and... Oh, it's crazy purple and Cheyenne! Oh, looks great. Really does, really looks good. And there you go, over a thousand ferocity. And these guys aren't even the fully, like, best ones, I don't think. This is the least one, this this little guy. Lanky Larry! Lanky legs. Oh, wow! Wow, he changed to, like, deer colors? And got some nice uh, yellow highlights. On. Awesome. And this is the least one, and it has 928 ferocity. So you can't shake a stick at even the lower ends of these. So, um... He, that one I'm saving for last. Uh, this guy will take... Oh, 125. Oh, there it is! D doesn't actually... Oh, we've leveled up as well! Awesome! Give me those three bucks! Jesus! Okay, uh, and we can feed this as well. It doesn't look too much different. There's no dumpling. I can't wait to use these. I think he's gonna be a little brute animation. Pretty sure. And finally, the crocodile! Gatorade! Oh! Looking badass! What lovely colorings! And this is these are four creatures that I have just bought, spent all my money on, and resources. And I have like so much left. Um Like look at it, I mean it was only one carnivore, so I spent all that on him. But look at that, I've got still got five million grass left, so they could still release more creatures, and I could still max them up. That's mental! Absolutely ludicrous, so. Oh, join me in a second, where we'll take them for a spin in the tournament! Right, here we are in the tournament, let's check the listings! Oh, oh look at that! No Ethereum! 
The pudding, sorry, the dumpling, little dumpling is so high. Look at, oh, that's amazing. Oh, wow, okay. I was I was expecting the, the, uh, the crocodile. Oh, oh my God, look at that. Cooper Trooper. And, oh, we've got, oh my God, we've got a new, you've got a new best sweeper. Titan Boa is no more. Oh my god! Capro Suchus Gatorade is the new best one! And even look at this! Uh, uh, Lanky Larry is, is ready! <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, guys. I just want to say, if you're wanting to uh, to spend your bucks on something like the Glacier or the Aquatic New Creatures that came out, uh, at the end of this video I will tack on a link to click on the Aquatic Creatures, but I just want to say right now, Go for the glacier creatures. They are so much more worth it. They, they're much higher ferocity and You'll be able to use these again. I'm just gonna say because this is tacked on. I've just done the aquatic creatures uh, Tournament and the bots are no longer nerfed So bear that in mind when you go fight the next that you may lose a lot of books if you have not if you do not know this knowledge so please please do not underestimate these bots do not use low-level creatures and I'll show you what I mean. <laughs> let's, let's just st stop talking, James. Just get on with the damn video. Why do you think people are here? So uh, now I, ha I have my cup of tea ready. Couldn't get more British than that, could you? With a British accent. <laughs> Actually, that was a French accent. And again, guests. Don't know why. Maybe they're choosing not to use uh, thingies anymore. Okay, have they fixed? No, uh, even Ethereum is still... Okay, usually they start with one creature. So, uh... We'll use, um, Land Whale, Dinosuchus, and Lanky Larry to take on that one creature. So we'll see, we'll see Lanky Larry's finish animation. We'll see, we've got to see Gatorade's finish animation. And I'm pretty sure, um, the pudding, sorry, the little dumpling is going to have the same animation as Little Brute. <laughs> I didn't even realize that. Little Brute, Little Dumpling. Oh my god, we've got macaroni, we're gonna have sausage. Macaroni, sausage, little dumpling, and Starbucks. You've got a breakfast, you've got a lunch even. We've got a breakfast team and lunch team. Just switch out, um, switch out little dumpling for something, and there you go. You've, you've got like, you got breakfast team and lunch team, oh, that's amazing. And I just thought, Gatorade and Kool-Aid need to meet. Somebody draw a fan art of that, please, please. Oh, Andrew, so Andrew, Land Whale, what are you doing? Die! <laughs> God! Get out of town! You're gonna kill this thing! Lanky Larry needs a chance, and Urinator. So we're gonna swipe it. Whoosh! Look at that haze stacking. I, I had no idea. I was in a live stream and I was trying to describe what that is when somebody kneels behind you and then the other person pushes you so you fall over them. And somebody was kind enough to tell me that's called haze stacking. Okay, there's one block used. I'm hoping he's gonna use a special now. I, w I want to see Lanky Larry. I want to see how big he is. If he's the same size as Indrik Ethereum or not, because they are literally the same animation. So I'm expecting the because with these four creatures that came out, one of them has a new animation, and I'm pretty sure that that new animation is gonna be Gatorade. Because Lanky Larry looks like it's Indrik Ethereum. I'm sorry, Erwinator, you're gonna have to swipe. Whap! Now that's nice. That's a really heavy, uh, heavily animated little scene there. Here he comes! Oh, wow! Oh, he looks depressed. He's, he's got a long tail, actually. Um, should we go for a special just in case they don't block? Yeah! Watch out! It's, oh, that's, oh, it's amazing! It's sort of like... It didn't whack to the side, it sort of whacked downwards. Oh, poor Lanky Larry, he's got such scrawny legs. On to the semi-finals. Okay, uh, I'm gonna save Gatorade to last. So, who who we got? We have Koopa Trooper. Oh, oh no, I wanna see Koopa Trooper. I, w I wanna see if it's the, like, the cannonball animation. So, we'll use more Ethereum. Elasmatherium 
This is Moetherium, Elasmotherium, Indicotherium. We could have an in, like a Eum team. And then, uh, and then meal, meal in it. Oh, I'm just gonna call it Koopa Trooper. Because they're turtle looking, so. Unless he's got his own unique animation. It's possible. Guys, oh. This, like, it is really late at night for me. Oh, wow, he looks awesome. Sorry, I just want to say he looks great. Wow, okay. What animation? No, it's a little brute animation, definitely. But it looks cool. It looks awesome. Bite it! Yum! Okay, I will use one special with him because I do want to see uh, what he can do. Again, the bots. These guys aren't nerfed anymore. So look at that 2,000 damage. That's around about right, I'd imagine. I mean, they seem to do a lot more damage than usual. Oh, he's facing head on, going for the charge! Kwabush! Oh, almost killed him! Almost took the beaver out, Jesus! Oh, poor little dumpling! <laughs> Don't say a word, Mama's gonna buy you a mockingbird! Bite it! Bite it on the schnoz! Oh, there it is, there's the block. Usually PCs don't let you win like that easy. If they've got a like a creature on low health and they have blocks, they'll use them. Okay, come on, Elasmatherium. Clear out this team for Kuba Trooper to storm in. Again, these creatures, this is this is like on the spot uh, recording, so these creatures will not have their special like rage modes and stuff like that, but they will have them when they're sort of highlighted in another video. So don't worry. They will have their own unique videos, just I need to get my books back up before I do that. I just wanted to show you guys these. Okay, again, these, are, these aren't nerfed anymore, so you cannot mess around anymore. Uh, you need to be tactical, which I'm not because I'm letting them hit me with specials. Look at that, two specials almost out. Usually I'd have half health, or at least a little bit more health now. So you have to be very careful. Okay, okay. Usually, if we have one creature left, and we've taken out one, that's good. So far, we're doing good. Yes! Come on, Elasmatherium, just get one more hit off. Or at least waste their block. Come on. Come on, you can do it. Okay, that's a block on. That's good. That means that we can basically go for specials without fear of them blocking at all. Here he comes! Hooper Trooper! Swipe it! Oh, God! He's got a heck of a jump on him for a little thing, doesn't he? But he has a lot of health. I want to see how much damage he can do. Charge is its weakness again. We don't know any of the creatures' creatures' weaknesses. So, you're learning it all right here. Don't go and make a video going, Well, I've just found out the weaknesses by myself. You watch this video. Don't lie. <laughs> Guys, everybody needs to see this. If you're a fan of Jurassic Park Builder, you need to see this. Share it on every Facebook page, every YouTube. Show it to your friends, these new creatures. Just have a whale of a time. Or a land whale of a time. I should. Oh, man, I should have said that. Have a land whale of a time. <laughs> that should be a t shirt. Have a land whale of a time. Bam! Get down. Sit your. Oh, it's macaroni. Don't mess about with macaroni. Okay, we're gonna see it special. I'm guessing it's gonna be the spinning death ball or cannonball. Is it? Oh, look at it go! Yes, it is! Whoopush! Oh, it's not enough! It is not enough! Uh, I'm gonna go for a block here. Again, I think we could survive a hit, but I'm just playing it safe because I do not want to lose. Um, so we've seen the death ball. We could use it again. Um, but... Yeah, a bite's gonna do it. A bite's gonna do it. Okay, use a block. Oh, I cannot wait to see Gatorade. I really can't. It's gonna have its own unique animation. You guys are gonna love it as much as I am, because I know you. You're like me, basically. Like, a lot of people. Oh, wow! I look so cool. He's got like a flat head. For Bowser! <laughs> So, like, a lot of you guys are just like me. You, like, play the same games, you have the same interests, and that's... I guess that's why you, you like... It's, it's, you watch me. <laughs> so, finally, we're gonna have Indricotherium dip Protodon. We're not wasting any time here. And then, look at that. His max attack is 3,240. 3, 
most attack of any creature in Glacier, and you're gonna see it live here! Well, not live, but you know, you're gonna see it here. <laughs> so we're against Master, we're against Baldy, Dodo, and Starbucks. Good team because they're no longer nerfed, and I've gotta be worried, uh, I've gotta be worried of this Mastodon. This Mastodon is what I'm gonna be scared of. So usually Indricotherium can win a match by itself. Oh my god! You know what just hit me? How hard the Jurassic Tournament is going to be now Now they're no longer nerfed. Ooh, okay, okay, no more messing around. No more nice Mr. Beaver. I'm going to bring out Angry Beaver. <laughs> There's going to be a fan out of that. Angry Beaver. Oh, I, I like, I'm on top of the world right now. And I hope you guys are too. I want to see this Gatorade. Come on. Come on, Little Cthulhu, don't mess about. Come on, don't be a drama queen. Watch, she's gonna fall over, watch. She's not gonna be hurt. Yeah, yeah, look look at that. Come on, drama queen. I should nickname you Drama Queen Indricotherium. <laughs> no, we've already got that for a uh, uh, drama queen, Amaga Amagasaurus? Yeah, that's the one. Bite it! Bite his bald head. Okay, Dodo, what you got? Oh, not enough! Look how- This is an unnerfed team, and still my Indrica Theorem is doing good. So you charge the dodo! Stamp on it! Okay, okay, I can do this. We can do this. Indrica Theorem, I'm sorry buddy, you are out. Bring in the gaming beaver! Charge it! Oh! Oh, I forgot! You know, it's been so long that they have used a block, I forgot they had those. Um... Eh, okay, okay. I want to see this Gatorade. I want to see this Gatorade, man. I, I just, I just want to see it. Oh, is somebody ringing me? Nope, I'm getting text. You guys are flying off the hook! Texting me- well, not text- Messaging me on Facebook, messaging me on YouTube, all these- <laughs> It's crazy, my phone's constantly buzzing. Okay, okay, Dodo, you are done. You're extinct. Oh, he is as well. Saving his box for Starbucks, obviously, to star player. Oh, there it is. It's gonna bring in Gatorade. Oh, it's not. Don't mess with the gaming beaver. Jeez. Okay, uh, you charge. Oh, there it is. They're exactly what they were doing, saving their blocks and specials for last. They've obviously- they obviously watch this program, they, they watch this show. Okay, come on Gatorade, what can you do? Oh, it's tiny! It's tiny, oh my god! Okay, charge. Oh, it's not got its own unique animation, it's got the Killer Kitty animation! Interesting. Oh! Oh! Oh my god, it looks amazing! Special it! Ooh, oh, look at it go. It prowls. It prowls. And then, plunges! Sort of. It doesn't hit the ca- Oh! Did you see that much attack? Oh my god, that was so much damage. I'm speechless. It looks awesome. That's a badass purple. A nice, um, nice colored uh, blue to go with it. Charge it! Yes, and there it goes. It wins! Oh, that's gonna make it- Oh, it looks awesome! That's gonna make an awesome thumbnail. Oh my god. And there we go. We got 20 bucks back. <laughs> I actually really need those 20 bucks. <laughs> oh, who saw the day when the Gaming Beaver needed 20 bucks? Right, well, I hope you've enjoyed this video. In a second, an annotation will come up just to send you to the aquatic one. You can also find it on my YouTube page anyway. For the new creatures, there's eight of them. That was four you just saw. So again, I hope you've enjoyed this video. I would not be here without you. You guys are the best. You're the reason why I keep doing this every single day. And the reason why I love it so, so much. And you can tell that I'm passionate and nothing is fake on this channel. There is not a moment that I'm depressed or annoyed or thinking I'm doing it just for money or something like that. I do it sincerely because I'm humbled by everything I've I've got, everything you've given me. That I went from like six months ago having nothing to having all of your support and 
we feel like a big family here and it's it truly is it's something that is indescribable so i'm not gonna waste any time trying to describe it so again leave a like if you've liked this video and hopefully i'll see you in the next one and until then bye bye